Hello, Roger Killen here. 63 days from now will be October the 19th, and that's when Get Inspired Talks produces its two events at the Playhouse Theatre. Today was all about attending to creating uh, uh, all the conditions to make a special upcoming training day for our speakers uh, be super efficient and super effective. Uh, that uh, training day, it takes place on Sunday, September the 8th, and we call it the Test Audience Day. The test audience is made up of uh, three groups. Uh, one group is the is a, is a, a, a new uh, seasoned speakers and speaker coaches that have never seen the uh, our, our speakers uh, perform before and know nothing about their talks. So the uh, the feedback that our speakers get from these individuals is uh, it's fresh and it's completely objective. The second group in the audience are the speakers themselves, uh, those who wish to stick around for more than their 30 minute time slot. Uh, uh, when speakers do this, they pick up all sorts of tips and tricks that they can then apply to make their talk, uh, take their talk to the next level. Uh, the third member of the audience is a video camera. And this will capture the speaker's delivery and provide the speaker with a uh, file uh, that they can then review with their own coach in order to tweak there, tweak here, tweak there, uh, and perhaps understand better the feedback they have received, uh, both, uh, uh, both in written form and uh, orally from the test audience. Uh, today was all about uh, arranging the test audience, uh, arranging the venue, uh, making sure uh, uh, lunch was available, all, all the myriad of details that go around ar arranging a training day. Another little detail, but an important detail that had to be done today was the design of the evaluation form. Uh, remember that each of our speakers' talks is a very special talk. It's intended to activate live and online audiences. Uh, that means it has to activate the test audience. There are two principal elements that go into, we'll call them drivers, that go into activating an audience uh, that are within the control of the speakers. Uh, the first is the speaker has to inspire the audience, and the second is the speaker has to deliver a crystal clear call to action that is uh, simple uh, and actionable and high impact whenever the test audience actually performs the call to action. Uh, there's a third element, and that is support after the event, but that's beyond the scope of what I was doing today. So there you go. That was today. Uh, uh, making sure that our test audience day on September the 8th would be effective and efficient. Roger and out.